I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign A sign I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign A sign I wanna be the greatest Everybody on the face shit I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest I make this every day and I'm impatient Hoping one day I blow up from the basement Stay mid, the Hi guys, thanks again for another opportunity to be here to discuss more about our desk in this lesson, we are talking about how to organize your work. And that involves making your code readable and making your parameters also grouped in such a way that it's easier for you and the users to see them. Now, let's check our desk. Go to 3D. Now, let's start with the parameters. As you can see, anything that relates to the desk settings has this tick. Unfortunately, I don't have the name for this, but what this tells you is that after the subheading, whatever has the tick becomes a member of that group. Now, if we progress down here, we realize we have this handle type, and this is, belongs to a different category. So how do you make this into a different uh, grouping? All you need to do is introduce a new parameter and make this one into a title. And you can give it uh, options. Also come here and give it options. And then make sure that this parameter belongs to the options by clicking on this, sorry. That's it, that's settled. And then you can see we have materials They're in the same group. We forgot to make this belong to that. Sorry, sometimes you need to double click several times. That belongs there. And then the pens, we have contour pen. Now, the other thing that is very, very important is coming here to details. Under details, you need to tell the computer what subgroup does this belong to. So you come to select, go to model, and from here you can see we have so many things. This one is a furnishing. It's, you can either decide it's a table or other furniture. Let's decide it's a table, enter, then you can write the other, Duke, the interior designer. You can describe office, sorry, office desk, keywords, you can talk of desk, office furniture and when you come to parameters you realize there are many many other parameters that have been added all you need to do is to remove the ones that you don't want for example we don't need this one we've already created ours that's cancelled. We've already made our materials. Takes time to click. And also this one. I think that's all that has been added. Let's go to 3D. You also need to make your coding tidy. What we do is to indent some of them so that it looks clean. Like if you have a prism, whatever be belongs to that prism, you can indent like the whole of this indent, you see, becomes neat. This one, nothing. And now you have a group, always indent. I may not do for everything, but where there's a group, 
make sure that you indent yes there indent on this one sorry that one make it a habit to indent things it makes your coding very very neat and also provide subtitles comments everything it makes your work very tidy and uh, that guys is uh, all about this topic thanks a lot and keep rocked here subscribe so that you can grow together in the design world thank you